My photography career started in the eighth grade when a science teacher inspired me to learn how to process film. And I developed a love of photography after that. In college, I actually studied geology. But upon finishing college, I decided that I couldn't avoid being a photographer. And I went to graduate school and got a master's degree in journalism. The kind of things that I love to photograph the most is interesting, rugged landscapes, but not just the landscape. I like to have people in the landscape as well. Either the people that live there or people that are visiting the place or, you know, outdoor athletes. That's what I really love to do. Right now, I'm standing in Antarctica. Well, actually, the South Shetland Islands just slightly off the Antarctic Peninsula. And this is truly one of the most unusual places I've been. The landscape is just ridiculous. Everywhere you turn, it looks like the best mountains ever. And so, you know, this really ranks way up there as one of the best places ever. I think traveling sustainably is more than just trying to make some magic trick to make your impact less on the planet. I think what's really important is to have an impact in where you go. And so when I travel places, I'm lucky enough to call and make connections with people who live there. And rather than just showing up in Paris and walking down the street and going up to the Eiffel Tower, I would try to find somebody who could give me a tour of Paris. Um, that's a really bad example because I almost never go to the cities. I like to go to the countryside. Um, but if I want to kayak to a hidden cave, I would find a kayak guide who could take me there, someone who's local, who really knows that place, and I can learn about it through them. And that way you're giving back to the place in addition to just, you know, taking your glee from that.